Oh, that's so close. Don't look at this. Hello everyone and welcome to my studio floor. I'm kind of wishing I'd hoovered, but never mind. I've also just realised in my viewfinder, the autofocus is thinking that's me. They think that's me. They think that's my face. So if I go out of focus, blame myself portrait. So you might have seen a few months ago, I tried a Taskmaster painting challenge where I had to poke my hole through the canvas and draw a self portrait. And it was a lot of fun. It was completely ridiculous. I loved every second of it. So today I wanted to try another Taskmaster painting challenge. And this time, I think it's from season 12 or season 13. And they basically had an option of painting the Taskmaster from either six feet away or six inches away. And I thought I would try it from six inches away because six feet away... I don't even know whether my floor to my ceiling is six feet. Well, it, it would have to be, wouldn't it? Because otherwise people wouldn't fit in the house. It would just be really impractical and very hard to do. This one's going to be very impractical and hard to do anyway. And I'm not going to be painting a picture of the Taskmaster, but I'm going to try and create a self-portrait from six inches away from my face. This is going to be almost impossible, and it's also going to be almost impossible to record. So, wish me luck. I need to set up. I haven't even planned anything. I literally just sat on the floor and started recording. So, if this is the size of my canvas, and I'm gonna be on the floor here. Six inches is so small. I need something to prop this up. I need to get under this canvas. Just thinking, what if I balance it on here? Would that be six inches? And then if I put one here, how am I gonna fit under it though? Oh, I'm too old for this. Ugh. Well, that's not six inches. That's definitely not six inches. But if I take another one away, that's gonna be far too small. About there. Oh my god. Are you absolutely kidding us? No, that's not six inches. You can't even see how little space I've got. I'll obviously move the cameras in a second. But that can't be six inches, can it? From my face to that canvas, is that six? That's not six inches. That's like one inch. Ah. Ah. Oh. I need help. This is why I need like an assistant or something to help us with recording. Also, I'm lying down and I, it's too hard to get back up. Ugh. Bear with us, we will get there. We'll get somewhere. And I know I'm still wearing my slippers. They're comfortable and it's a bit cold today. Oh yeah, I think that's about the right height. How tall do you think that is? Is that six inches from there to there? Actually, I think that's about right. I'm not going to get a measuring tip because I can't be asked. So I need some pens. I haven't even got pens yet. Did you ever see a beached whale? I feel like this idea was a mistake. I'm just just telling you now. Okay, I've readjusted the cameras and I think I'm finally happy with my setting. I've got three cameras set up. Number one, number two, number three. This one's very up close and personal. I don't like this one. Hopefully that one will be able to catch my drawing. Right, let's try and draw my self-portrait. And I know in the original episode of Taskmaster they used paint, but there is absolutely no way I'm using paint for this because it'll be all over us. It'll be all over my carpet. Just an absolute mess. So I'm using pens. So I need to start off with my face. Ah, oh, this is so disorientating. I know for a fact this is just gonna look like every other drawing I've ever made in my life. We'll go for eyes. Mouth. Who am I kidding? This is gonna look absolutely nothing like us. None of my drawings ever do to be fair. A little nose. Well that's not right. This is a lot easier than the last one mind. Way easier. Because I can actually see what I'm doing. But my arm's starting to fall asleep. Okay. Glasses and eyes done. I don't know whether I ever talked about when I had that MRI. Well, it wasn't similar to this. The MRI was way worse, but it's got the similar kind of claustrophobic effect. Right, neck and body. It's a skinny neck, that's fine. Move it forward. Ugh. Oh, I don't like this at all. <laughs> I'm starting to get irritated. It's surprisingly quite stressful being under here and trying to move around. I still think this is a very generous six inches. I think this is more like eight inches, but it, it's still quite weird and a bit freaky. Right, I need a different color, I think. Oh wait, no, before I do that, I'll add my mustache and my beard. Oh, I'm so uncomfortable, you have no idea. My arm's falling asleep. Oh, my arm, it's going dead. Hang on a second. I just need a little break. My arm's going to sleep. How long am I into it? I can't even see. I'm six minutes in and my arm's asleep. Like, full on dead. Where's my pen lid gone? Oh, I found it. No, I haven't. Where have I put the pen lid? Oh, I don't know where it's gone. Can <laughs> someone send help? Help is on the way! Oh, I found it. All right, I'm just going to take a minute because... 
It's too stressful. Also on Taskmaster, they were on like a wheelie thing. So I feel like that was nicer for them because they could wheel in and out of this. And I, I feel stuck. I feel like I can't get out. I'm just gonna have like two seconds. Just, just to myself. It's weird though, because when I went in for my MRI, they asked us if I was claustrophobic, and I was like, I'm not. And if someone went into an MRI and they actually suffered with claustrophobia, they would have a panic attack. They would have literally a nervous breakdown. I don't know whether anyone else has had an MRI. Awful, awful experience. And this is bringing back memories. It's a lot quieter than an MRI though. An MRI was so loud. I need a blue. Right, come on, we can do this. I always find as well, I don't know whether anyone else is like this, but if you've been laid on your back for long, enough. Does it make you need a wee? Because I can't sleep on my back at night time because I need a wee from it. I don't know whether that means something, but it just makes us need a wee. I think when you're not aware that you're like stuck underneath something, it's fine. It's as soon as you start to become conscious and aware of the fact that you're stuck underneath something, then you start to get stressed. <laughs> I'm giving myself some gorgeous red lips. I know my lips aren't this red, but they could be this red if I put some lipstick on. I just look like I've been eating something. My arm's going to sleep again. I can't believe my arm's going to sleep already. The thing is, I don't want to rush it because I want it to look quite nice, but it's it's actually quite stressful. I'm not enjoying myself, I'll tell you that. I'll just put in arms there and then maybe he's Oh yeah, that's what it was missing. How long have I been in now? I've only been in for 10 minutes. It feels like I've been in a lifetime. It's been 84 years. I know I'm only literally under a canvas and I could just poke my head out and everything's fine. But it's, I don't know, it's, it's freaky. Try it at home and you'll understand how weird it is. Hair, I always struggle with hair and I never know what colour my hair is. And um, it goes left. I've made my head way too big. I'm gonna have to use my left hand. My right arm is completely dead. Oh, where's my lid gone? Oh, I've got it. Right, hair's kind of done. I'll add just like a little bit of orange in just to give it some texture. I can't remember what they were like in this episode of Taskmaster. I can't remember whether they were like super stressed out or not. This is awful. I'd be very surprised if they weren't. I know it had, she called Morgana or something. I think she's very funny. What happened to Helen? I don't fucking know. I think I had her in. It was a really good season that season. I'm just gonna try and add a little bit of detail. I'm just gonna have another little break. I don't know whether we're allowed breaks on Taskmaster, but I think, I think I'm allowed. I'm just gonna have a sip of my cork wherever I've put it. I'll be back in a second. If I can get out. Oh, that's so close. Don't look at us. Oh, don't look at me! Right, okay, back in we go. Ugh. I need some pink for my skin. I don't have like a white person's skin colour, so I'm just gonna be obnoxiously pink. Looks good to me. Bit more black there. All about the details. It must be something to do with like your blood flow on why body parts fall asleep when they're in a certain position. But if you do this and your arms are up, your arms, you, they, they stop working. <laughs> Ah, oh, I'm looking so good, I can already tell. It's also quite hard to actually see the full picture when you're so up close to a t-shirt. Oh, I'll just give myself a blue t-shirt. Oh, I'm gonna have to go further down. <laughs> I think that's looking all right. No. Yes. Shall I do a bit of background? Oh, where's that red at? I haven't used a lot of red, so I might just do some red squiggles just to fill in some of the empty space. It can be like a celebration. I'd be so good on Taskmaster. All I would do is complain. I would just complain constantly about everything and anything. Also, some of you said before in the last one that they have Taskmaster in different countries. Obviously, I knew they had it in New Zealand, but they have it in Australia as well. And I was watching, I think the first season of the Australia one is really good. Some of the contestants they had on were hilarious. Areas. So I would recommend checking more of them out if you can. Right, I think I might be done because I hate it under here. I hate it so much. Get me out. Oh. It was 18 minutes. I've been under there for 18 minutes. No wonder I'm so tired. Okay, so it's time for the grand reveal. I feel like I look like an absolute mess. Ta-da! <laughs> you know what? I don't think that's too bad at all. I think the resemblance is uncanny. I don't know why I made the head so round for. I feel like I've got more of a long face than like a very circle face. Definitely think it was a better job than the last one I did. I will say as much fun as it was to do and to take part in this challenge and stuff, it was surprisingly, I wouldn't say difficult. It wasn't necessarily difficult to do the drawing or anything. It was difficult to be under there. It's just so confined and awful and I hated every second. 
second of it. I wish I hadn't done it. But there we go, another lovely self-portrait to add to my ever-grown collection of absolutely terrible portraits. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And the people of Taskmaster still haven't got in touch asking me to be on the show ever since the last video. So if you see this video, you're more than welcome to bring me on and I'll, I'll happily do it. I'll do it for free. I've already told you I'll do it for free. You don't even need to pay as anything. I just want to be on the show. Actually, no. I, to be fair, I don't think I would do very well on the show anyway because they have to like eat shit. Not literal shit, but they have to like eat vile things and stuff. I think I would be an awful contestant. I might do a bit of reverse psychology. Don't, don't, don't ask me to be on. I don't even know whether I want to be on anymore. And I'll see you next week for a brand new video. I am knackered. I am so tired. I'm shocked. I'm shocked this has killed us. You know you're getting old when you spend some time on the floor and you struggle to get back up. And that's what, that's what's happened today. It's made me realize that I'm getting on. I'm becoming a frail old man. I need a cup of tea. <laughs> oh.